Let's run through your lines for tonight's performance just uh, one more time. <laughs> Ready? Take it! <laughs> oh, that was wonderful, wonderful. Now, don't go away, Cast. I'll be right back. Oh, oh, hello there, yes. The cast and I were just rehearsing our roles for tonight's dramatization of that great episode from the Bible, Noah's Ark. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me for just one moment. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, here we are. Oh, oh, it should be good for the scene where I build the ark in preparation <laughs> for the big flood. <laughs> Let me see now. Oh, oh this will be the main man. Uh, oh, oh, my God, it's starting to rain. Hold it, no, it's too soon. Stop the water. And it was supposed to be a dry run. Hold it. came to pass, when men began to multiply on the face of the earth, God saw that the wickedness of man was great, and that his mind and his heart were filled with evil. Eight spots, I'll take the gold! Hold on! Let me see those dice. Are you calling me a cheat? Yes, those dice are crooked. Let them have it! And the Lord regretted that he had made man to live on the earth. But Noah found grace in the eyes of the Lord, for Noah was a just man, the best of all the men of his time. Noah, my friend, such a rare honor for you to pass our way. Come, join me in a drink of wine. <laughs> Thank you, Jarrah, but I, I have not the time. I see Japheth, my youngest son. <laughs> have you seen him? He is inside. Yeah. <laughs> Tell him that his father has returned to his home to thank his God that there is still a piece of earth <laughs> where the air is pure. <laughs> upon the earth, and behold, it was corrupt, for all flesh had corrupted his way upon the earth. Oh, 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 dear Lord, I pray thee forgive them for their sins and teach them the right way while there is yet time. spoke unto Noah. Noah, Noah, my son, hearken unto me. I am the Lord thy God. The end of all flesh is come before me, for the earth is filled with their violence. And behold, I will destroy them with the earth. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. And the Lord said, Make thee an ark of gopher wood. And behold, I shall bring a flood of waters upon the earth to destroy all flesh under heaven that has the breath of life. And thou shalt come into the ark, thou and thy sons and thy wife and thy sons' wives with thee. And of every living thing, two of each sort, shalt thou bring into the ark. They shall be male and female. Birds of all kinds and creatures of all kinds shall come to you to keep them alive. in that room, badly wounded and raving from the fever because of you. Shem, is this the truth? And, and the Lord spoke to me 
to me, Noah. Oh, the earth and all the people on it. It shall be destroyed. Oh, my poor husband. The fever is worse. Father, well, what is it? He went to find you, Japheth. He was robbed and beaten. Tell me who did this to you, Father. I will find him and kill him with my bare hands. No, 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 my son. Japheth is right. We will all go. No. No, no, no. If such is the wickedness of the earth that the Lord would destroy it, must my own son soil their hands with blood? It is all right, Father. We will do nothing that displeases you. Thank you, my sons. You are good boys. And tomorrow at daybreak, then we will begin to build the ark. Oh, yes, we have much work to do. And much work. Shh, shh, shh. Sleep, Father. Sleep. And in the morning, Noah rose from his bed, and the pain and the hurt were no more. All his beauty. The Lord created so much beauty. Can it be that he must destroy it? And the words of the Lord rang again in the ears of Noah. For the earth is filled with their violence, and behold, I will destroy them with the earth. It is true. The Lord has spoken to me, and, and, and I must obey. Father, are you well? I... I am well, my son. Come, come, we will call your brothers. We must go to the forest this very day to cut the timber with which to build the ark. Father, you had a blow on the head. It caused you to dream. No, no, it was no dream. Would you have me disobey the Lord's command? No, but... There will be no alternative, Shem. I will build the ark with your help or, or without your help. <laughs> yes, as, uh, as you wish it. Then you will have our help, Father. If your father asks your help, will you refuse it? But we must harvest the grapes before the rain set in, or they will be destroyed. Father believes that we must build the ark before the rain set in, or we will be destroyed. What are we to do? We are to do as our father wishes. But it is folly, and you well know it. I know only that he is our father. And right or wrong, he is the head of the family. And we are going to obey him. Thus did Noah according to all that God commanded him. From sunup to sundown, day after day, did he and his sons labor. Japheth, look. Two men are watching. Who are they? Village men, I suppose. Yesterday I saw another. What do they come for? <laughs> what do they come for? Where else can they see a boat being built in the middle of a vineyard and the nearest water many miles away? Soon everyone will hear and will come to laugh. Oh, <laughs> you see, <laughs> did I not tell the truth? <laughs> if I did not see it with my own eyes. An ark <laughs> big enough to carry an army. <laughs> hey, Noah! But Japheth is a child of a man. He plans to carry it on his shoulders to the sea. <laughs> I will not stand for another word from these people. No, 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 Japheth. Do not condemn them. They are to be pitied. They are to be pitied? We are to be pitied, wasting our time on this folly. No wonder they taught us. And my sons, I've done a great deal of thinking lately, and I feel that... What I am doing is wrong. Then you have come to your senses, Father. We can dismantle the ark and cut it for firewood. We will think of some story to tell everyone. No, no, no. We, we must tell them the truth. I can look upon these neighbors no longer knowing that they are doomed. They must be warned. Please, neighbors, neighbors, hear me. The Lord has spoken to me and told me to build this ark. And soon he will bring a flood of such magnitude that all the peoples of the earth shall be destroyed. You must, you must, all of you go home and build vessels so that you and your loved ones may be saved. <laughs> that man is possessed by evil spirits.
did all that the Lord commanded him. And when he saw the faces of his neighbors watching him build the ark, his heart was sore and heavy for them. But Noah and his sons did finish the ark and did stock it with some of every kind of food that is eaten. That is the last of the food, Father. The storerooms are now filled to bursting. Then the time is nearing. You are a good son, Shem. We love you, Father. Of that, I am proud. Well, this is the last of it. We are finished. Perhaps now the curiosity seekers will grow bored and, and find other amusements. If you have no more tasks for us now, my brothers and I would like to save what we can of the vineyards. Not yet, my son. Have you forgotten the greatest task of all is before us? We must now collect a pair of every living creature on the face of the earth. This foolishness has gone far enough. Our crops are ruined. Our friends and neighbors jeer and throw stones at us because we have catered to the whims of a father who has grown old and feeble-minded. <laughs> I will have no more of it. I will not hunt animals to keep them amused. <laughs> Father, please forget this folly. I cannot disobey the Lord. <laughs> My husband, listen to your sons. Perhaps they are right. Go to the house with your sons, woman. I have the command of God, and I will fulfill it alone. If I must. <laughs> there is a rabbit, Noah. Catch it quickly before it escapes. Look at it, Noah. It's running away. <laughs> the rabbit, you old fool. See the rabbit. Go catch it, Noah. Here. Here, little creature. Come. I will not harm you. <laughs> Come. <laughs> Come, little one. Uh, come. Come uh, right in, get over here. Why don't you use a spear, Noah? Do you hear any voices now, Noah? Oh, oh. Oh, that's a storm. Father, it was but a dream. No. No, it was not a dream. Nor am I an old fool. Oh, Lord. Lord, show me the way. <laughs> oh, what's in? Oh, 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 my little frightened friend. Oh, and you brought Mrs. Rabbit with you. Yes, yes, hippity hop, go right on board and make yourself at home here. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome here, Mr. Bain. 
Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Zebra, yeah. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. New. Oh, yeah, let's stay in line here, please, Mr. and Mrs. Elephant. I see you run your trunk and stuff. Oh, the snakes and turtles and the insects. You, there's such a lot of you. Now, you birds, quiet down now. Oh, let's keep moving. Here, Mr. and Mrs. Camel. Oh, you, Mr. and Mrs. Camel. And two by two, the beasts and birds and everything that creeps upon the earth went into the ark. And Noah's wife and his son's wives and his sons went into the ark as God had commanded Noah. Everyone is aboard! He's just in Dorham! Oh, what, what's this? <laughs> oh, oh, Mr. Tomcat! Ooh, ooh, ooh. You almost didn't make it! <laughs> The same day, all the fountains of the great deep were broken up, and the windows of heaven were opened, and the rain fell upon all the earth. And it came to pass after seven days that the waters of the flood were upon the earth, and the ark went upon the face of the waters. So, I take care of you. Help us. Yeah. And some for puss. Oh, oh, my. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Bobber! Bobber, the ark! We are floating! Yes, yes, I know. The Lord chose the time very well indeed. There now, there now, noble beast. A meal to, to keep you strong. No, no, I am your friend. There, no need to fear me. Come, come now. That's it. Let us be friends. Oh, 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 oh so the female is the brave one. Very well. Oh, no, I apologize. You are both brave. Patience, patience, Mr. Elephant. Your turn will come. Oh, they eat so much, Father. I hope we have enough food to last until this is over. <laughs> there will be enough. Well, now, oh, that long neck <laughs> does serve a purpose. Oh, how I long for the feeling of solid ground under my feet. We are all inconvenienced, my son. When the Lord is ready, <laughs> the rains will cease. For forty days and forty nights, the rain fell upon the earth, and the darkness and gloom penetrated into the ark. Here! Here now, here, stop it at once! Oh, oh this will never do! Stop it, stop, stop it, I say! You criticize everything that I do, and I'm tired of it! I am sick to death of your ways! And I am sick to death of yours! No, I did not. Yes, you did so! The days are long and the rain is endless. It is almost more than man or animal can bear. And God remembered Noah and every living thing that was with him in the ark. And God made a wind to pass over the earth. And the fountains of the deep and the waters of heaven was stopped. What is it? Oh, I, I, I hardly dare to think. The rains have ceased. Soon it'll be all over. waited for seven days, and he sent forth from the ark a dove to see if dry land could be found. But the dove returned to the ark. Still there was hope. Soon the waters would recede and there would be a new life. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> there will be a new life. I 
think we must find dry land soon. Once again, Noah sent forth a dove. And once again, the dove returned to the ark. <laughs> Not yet, little dove. <laughs> I had hoped it would be this time. Father, come quickly. I have a son, and you have a grandson. This is my son. This is my grandson. <laughs> For a third time, Noah sent forth a dove from the ark, and for a third time it returned. Father, our food stores are dangerously low. If we do not... Yes, yes, my son, I know. But we must have faith. Well, <laughs> what is this? What are you saying to me, my little friend? Oh, oh, is it goodbye, then? Father, does this mean... I believe so, Shem. I believe they have found dry land. And this time the dove returned to the ark no more. And it came to pass that the ark struck solid ground and moved no more. And Noah looked out, and behold, the ground was dry. Dear Lord, we thank thee. We thank thee. And the Lord spoke unto Noah and to his sons with him, saying, Never again will all flesh be cut off by the waters of a flood, nor will a flood destroy the earth. And it shall come to pass, when I bring a cloud over the earth, that the rainbow shall be seen in the cloud. I will look upon it, and I will remember the everlasting covenant between God and every living creature upon the earth. is a little easier when you have friends to the end. It's time for some dreaming and scheming, babysitter style. Coming up next, it's the Babysitter's Club, right here on Disney. <laughs> 